Welcome to another love reading of yours. This is the Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. This is a general reading, guys. This may or may not resonate with every Libra watching this video. Some of the energies of the cards here can be flipped, so feel free to switch those energies, vice versa. Um, time is fluid, as you know. You could have dealt with this energy and we'll be dealing with it in the near future. Okay? If you don't need a personal reading, all that information is going to be down below. Let's do this. So, Libra, right now I see with the judgment in reverse here, I think there is indecision. Okay, this is someone being indecisive. Again, indecision due to two things. One, fear of making the wrong choice or fear of making the wrong decision or um, someone who's just not wanting to repeat their past mistakes, okay? This could be someone, you know, who does not want to give something a second chance because they don't want to repeat the past mistakes. Someone could be giving something a chance over and over and over again and now they're like, I'm done. Or this is just someone who's, you know, this is this is someone who's just not listening to the universe, okay? Someone who's not listening to uh, what the universe has to say, okay? They're, they're literally ignoring the signs synchronicities from the universe, okay, to give this a second chance. Libra, with the Six of Swords in reverse here, on your mind, logically, you're very, very stuck, okay? Again, with the Six of Swords in reverse here, I feel, Libra, that you need to make a very important change. You're resisting a very important change, okay? You know that if you need to get through calmer waters, you need to make that change, but you're not being able to make that change. With the Six of Swords in reverse here, again, either you, I, I'm getting more like, this is someone repeating the same mistake of going back to the same things that they did in the past, okay? So again, I think Libra, you're repeating a negative pattern over and over again, okay? That's why you're feeling stuck. You're not being able to move forward. Because this is a change of thought, okay? Your subconscious thoughts. It's almost like whatever happened in the past, right? You haven't healed and you're falling from one frank pant into another. Okay, without being healed. And that's one of the situations, one of the reasons why your feelings are stuck out here. The person that you're dealing with is the five of pentacles. Okay, so this person's feeling shut out and left out in the cold by you. This, you could be ignoring this person, okay, or this person feels ignored by you. You probably shut them down. This could be a breakup, separation. But there's a lack of reconciliation right now with the current situation, okay? Someone's getting the cold shoulder right now. This is, this is the person who's getting it. In your emotions, you know, you feel a strong soul type connection with this person. With the lovers here, this is your twin flame, soulmate, twin flame connection if you believe in it, all right? But yeah, with the lovers here, you, you, this is a strong soulmate connection, a, a strong twin flame connection. You're very attractive. You love this person. You want this person, okay? But with the six of wands in reverse here, there has some mutual energy, okay? With the devil in reverse here, I'm sorry. Let's get to them. In their emotions, with the devil in reverse here, they're ready to release anything that is toxic, okay? They're ready to release or in the process of releasing a toxic situation or something that is just not healthy, okay? This could be a situation where they felt very stuck, tied and bound to something, okay? Where they would, tr no matter how hard they would try to get out of it, they just couldn't do it, okay? That's just how the devil energy is. But yeah, they're ready to release it, okay? Emotionally, they're ready to let go of anything that's stopping them from moving forward or anything that's stopping them from making like, uh, you know, forward progress. But again, devil and reverse is something, you know, where you're releasing a connection or um, this could, could even be ego, but you're not letting some, you're not, feed, they're not feeding into temptation anymore. Maybe this person felt that this was a very toxic, connect, toxic connection and now they're no more ready to feed into the temptation, okay? They're ready to let it go. With the mutual energy of the six of wands and reverse, I feel you're both not sure if you want to make, move forward or not. But what I'm getting here is that there are prob there's probably an ego issue between you guys, okay? Over inflated egos, arrogance, one person thinks they're better than the other, whatever, right? But there's a lack of forward movement here. You both want to, but you're still not sure if you really want to, okay? Because again, it could either be an upright or a reverse. But when it comes in between, I mean, I'm just feeling like it's just both of y'all, okay? You're both like in that, I'm not sure, I'm not sure, I'm not sure. With the lovers here, you could also be having a choice to make, okay? This is a life-changing, significant decision that you need to make, okay? And they, on the other hand, they're ready to release something that's very toxic. We're going to see once we clarify. Your attitude towards them is you're losing hope. You don't even have faith in this connection. You don't think that this is going to work out. And they, with the Six of Pentacles in reverse here, they feel that they're getting, they're their attitude towards you is like either they're getting the bare minimum or they're giving you the bare minimum, okay? They're not wanting to invest into this connection right now or they feel they're forcibly giving into this connection. Alright, let's clarify. Why is the judgment in reverse? 
four of pentacles because someone's holding back. Mm -hmm. Someone's at a state of shutdown. This is someone who's not wanting to open up, someone who's blocking their heart chakra, and they're just being very, very stubborn right now, okay? Someone's not wanting to make a decision right now. And I think Libra, this is you because with the six of swords in Libra, so you're the one who's stuck here. I think you, you guys have parted ways. I can see that, right? This person feels left out in the cold and you, on the other hand, you want to return to this person. Okay, you want to. But you're stuck because you know that if you want to be with this person or if this person needs to be with you, there has to be some very significant change that needs to happen. But it's not happening from either side or your side. Why the Six of Swords in reverse here? Someone's holding back. That's why the decision is not being made. This could be someone who's not wanting to be even vulnerable. Why the Six of Swords in reverse? With the tower here. Why is the tower here? You've had some kind of a realization or why is the tower here? Why is the tower? Seven of swords, you're trying to avoid a disaster. you definitely there is definitely in your emotions uh, in your logic right because on your mind you feel that some, it's just when things are just going to crash and that's why you're trying to avoid it or there is you know that you're resisting again Libra yeah for you I'm getting that you're resisting a huge change that is going to be like life changing for you okay but you're definitely clearly ignoring it with the seven of souls here. you're trying to get away you're trying to sneak away from it okay you're trying to take the easier way out because with the tower here, you know that there's a huge shake up that's needed. There's a huge, um, something needs to shake up. Something needs to completely crash for it to be rebuilt again, okay? And that's something that you're ignoring. That's why you're stuck into this. Libra, you're the one who's trying to ignore and avoid this entire change. I said that before also. Why is this person the five of pentacles in their mind? With the four of swords in reverse and the five of cups in reverse. So this person feels left out in the cold here, okay? They're feeling shut down. With the four of swords in reverse and the five of cups in reverse. I feel this person is wanting to come out of isolation. They want to talk to you, okay? They want to end this, um, uh, uh, they, they want to end this time out, okay? They want to end this break. Probably there's, a lack, uh, probably there's a break between you guys. Again, you guys are in no communication or there's a time out. They want to come out of that, okay? They definitely want to talk to you because they're missing you a lot. They feel abandoned by you. But the five of cups in reverse, I feel this person wants to, is ready to move forward, okay? They're no more wanting to cry the spilt milk. I feel this person probably wants to release whatever toxicity was there in the past. But yeah, this person's ready to move on, okay? I think this person's wanting to get over. I don't feel more of getting over you, but I feel this person is trying to, you know, like, all right, like, let's try this again. I'm getting more like, because they definitely want to have this conversation with you, okay? They want to come out of that, a no communication mode and talk to you but you on the other hand you are completely trying to avoid this communication okay because you think i mean things are just going to completely uh, crash or something's just going to happen and it's just going to take the foundation of the entire relationship and you're the one resisting that change you're not being able to make that change uh why are the lovers here why is the lovers here Eight of Wands. You feel this. You feel this, Libra. You feel this strong soul type connection, but you're just purposely holding back. Why is Eight of Wands in the rush here? With the world here, you want to start a new chapter with this person, okay? But with the Eight of Wands in reverse here, you're holding back on purpose. Look, with the Seven of Swords here, that is someone being deceptive. That's someone who's trying to do things on purpose. I'm getting you, brother. There's something that you're trying to avoid from crashing. You're trying to avoid a disaster. And because you're so scared, you're, you're fearing that huge change that's going to come in. You're trying to ignore this entire thing. And this person out there, right? This person is feeling left out by you. They want to communicate with you, right? But they're just going to move on if you're not going to make a move. You're the one holding back here with the four of pentacles here. You're the one who's not being able to make a decision. This is indecision, being indecisive, fear of making a wrong choice, or just fear of um, you going through the entire change that you're going to have to make if you make a decision, like a very assertive decision. But yeah, with the eight of wands in reverse in the world here, you're holding back. You want to start a new chapter with this person. You see this connection with them, but you're just holding
in that you're purposely trying to delay the progress. Why the devil in reverse? This person is releasing things and with the queen of pentacles here, I think this person is very focused on their work with the strength here. This person is holding back. They're catching on your energies and they're holding back. They're catching on your energies and they're holding back. Now there is someone and now they're focusing on themselves. They feel you're extremely toxic because I think Libra, you could have done this over and over and over again. There could have been a negative pattern. Every single time life hits you hard or this shit goes wrong in this relationship, you go back to being the same shit over and over again. Again, Libra, it could be you, it could be the cross watcher. Okay, I'm going to read it out as Libra. So I think you keep going back to the same thing again with the Seven of Swords, yes, self-denial, sabotaging the connection, a lot of uh, sneaking, a lot of being deceptive, wearing a false mask. I, I think this person is done with that. I mean, they're already restless, they're reaching a boiling point, okay, they're reaching that point of exhaustion. I mean, every single time that happens and you leave them out in the cold, okay, and probably you're the one who's very stubborn and closed off. But now they're holding back with the strength here. I think they're putting in all their effort in with the Queen of Pentacles. They're putting in all their effort in creating their own stability, their own security. And I think this person is wanting to focus on themselves only. Not like it's in the reverse where they're focused only that on their finances. But I think their attention is completely on themselves now. And with the strength here, they could have put in all the, their inner strength, their confidence. They're going to do everything and anything that it takes to take the situation. That's what they're doing and they're releasing in their, in their emotions. They want to release this toxic situation because they're fed up of it. They're no longer crying over spilt milk. This person could have really, really tried to get you to a mature level, okay? I think Libra, you're the one who's being very immature out here. This person's trying their best. But now that you haven't given in, now that you haven't come on the same energetic level that they are in, they're just going to let you be, is what I'm getting. Why is the Six of Wands here as a mutual energy? Why is the Six of Wands in the Wands here as a mutual energy? Two of Cups. See, that's what I'm saying. There's so much love here. Yeah. There's so much love here. You both have this mutual love for each other, okay? But again, overinflated egos, arrogance, or again, both of you are doubting, or one person is doubting if they can make this relationship happen, okay? There's a lot of fear in her, and I think the fear is coming from this side, from you, Libra. There is a lot of love here, okay? You both have love for each other, but again, you both are just not sure if you want to move forward or not. Maybe someone who is listening to too many people's opinions, or this is just someone who's, who has a lot of self-doubt, okay? You could be having commitment issues, Libra, with a lover of yours. It's like you, you, you feel this connection, right? But you're holding back communication with the Eight of Wands in reverse here. I mean, that's so weird in your emotions, right? With the world here, you probably could have think, you could probably feel that things have come to an end. Or you could also be wanting to open a new chapter with this person, okay? Um, why is the star in reverse here as your attitude? Why is this as me plus attitude? Why is the star in reverse? Why is the star in reverse? We have the Empress. So you look at this person as marriage material. Alright, you definitely look at this person as marriage material. You look at this person as the Empress, okay? You feel they're very self-reliant. This is someone abundant. Uh, you want to marry them. You want kids with them. This is someone very, very beautiful. You put this person on a pedestal. But at the same time, you see this person as someone who's very, very... They're on their own. They don't need anyone, okay? This person is someone who's very smart. Someone who's got their shit together, okay? Uh, they realize their self-worth and value, okay? But you probably... Do you doubt yourself? Do you feel you're not worth this person? I don't know. That's the kind of feeling I'm getting. But you don't have hopes that this person is probably going to take you back. With the Ten of Cups, you're saying you want everything with this person. You want... This is your happily ever after. You see them as your end of the okay? But the problem here is that your attitude, and the attitude is what always works, right? Into making or breaking a relationship. Your attitude is the start and reverse. You don't have faith or hope that this connection is going to work out. 
But what? You're the one who's pulling things up here. I don't think it's them. I think it's you. Knowingly or unknowingly, okay? But six of swords in reverse here, that's all about your subconscious thoughts. Okay? It's all about your subconscious thoughts. Why is the six of pentacles in reverse here? Now they don't want to give in to this. Either they're giving, they wanted to give in bare minimum or they just feel that they're not getting what they deserve, right? So I don't, I don't think they're wanting to invest into this anymore. Why is the six of pentacles in reverse? 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 Oh, it. They're isolating themselves. I don't think they're going to take any action. Why is the hermit here? Why is the hermit here? Why is the hermit here? And the judgment. You're, with the current situation with the judgment in reverse here, I think you are the one who's not making a decision, Libra, or someone's not and someone's holding back. But because you're not making the decision, they're making the decision for you and I think their decision is to walk away. I don't see the eight of cups here, but it's almost like, well, they're not investing, they're not going to be giving you the bare minimum or they're just not going to give into the situation anymore because they feel that you're abusing your power or you're, you're you know, you're, you're um, Almost like taking them for granted, okay? Someone's been, because they feel they've been taken for granted and with that moment in the judgment here, right? I think this person's not going to... They're isolating themselves. They're walking away. This person needs alone time and that's their judgment. That's their final decision. Mm -hmm. Why is the Queen of Cups in reverse here? It's a very assertive decision, by the way. So yeah, with that moment here, I think this person's going to be ghosting you for a while. They're going to be very focused on their work. And believe me, with the strength here, you can't shake that woman off. She's, can you see? She's trying to tame the lion. She's trying to put something in, in the lion's mouth. This person really going to put in every, every inch of what they have to tame the situation. They're not going to give in, Libra. I think they've had enough. <laughs> okay. For the Queen of Cups in reverse and the Fool in reverse, I didn't ask a question, but I feel this is... It was meant to be the pool in reverse. So someone's shut down emotionally. They're going to be very, very emotionally unavailable, emotionally cold. Uh, this is someone who's just going to completely detach themselves. And with the pool in reverse here, there's someone here who's not wanting to take a risk ahead because they've gone through hell and back. They have trust issues. And this is someone who's just not ready for a new beginning with you, Libra. Yep, they're shut off to this. And with the judgment here, it's quite a final decision. And all this is only because of your in and out, in and out, in and out behavior. Or probably because you're holding back too much or you're fearing change or fearing commitment, whatever, right? It's in your attitude, but when it comes to your emotions or when it comes to your logic, you're not making that move, you're not making, I don't see any action taken from you. This person's just going to be focused on themselves. So if you're not making the decision, Libra, they're going to make it already. Yep, yeah, but there's someone here who's just not going to be, um, they're choosing to suppress their emotions, okay? And they're not going to take a risk with you. Again, Libra, you can split, split the sides. So that's what I have for you, Libra. I hope this reading resonates. Leave your comments below. Like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.